face of the king. Ah! She won't get away with this! Your Highness. How dare she humiliate me in front of all these nobles! Who dares humiliate you? The Cake Queen! Oh, this is a fantastic ah, a beautiful feast, I must say. Filet mignon, lobster, and chicken. Ah, oh, no fair, but sis! Butter waffle, what have you done to deserve such a beautiful feast anyway? If you're not on Waffle Gram all day, you're on Cake Book! <laughs> or chasing after every delicious dessert you see! The way you spend money, you don't deserve such food! Well, you should be the one to talk. You deserve to eat nothing but slop! What? She told me I could only eat that awful slime! Mm. I've never been so ashamed before! Very humiliating, I'm sure. And that's not all! <laughs> Would you like to go yachting with me this weekend? Wow, you have a yacht, sire? <laughs> this is so cool! <laughs> Butter waffle! Hmm? Aren't you a little old to be wet in the bed in the middle of the night? Here, clean it up yourself! Oh, no way! Is that true? This could be problematic. Yes. I didn't do it really! Hard pass on that yacht trip! <laughs> I'll show her! I'll see her dethroned and then I will be king! Would you really like to become king, sire? Hmm? If that's really what you want, then I have an idea. <laughs> Evening, Bred the Barber, I presume. That's right, but who are you? There is someone who needs your skills, sir. Hmm. <laughs> Uh, 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 uh. Hmm. Oh, is it really? That's uh, right. I present uh, the Honorable Prince Butterwaffle the first, uh, second in line to the throne. The whispers are that you can give me a face fit for a king. Hmm. And where did you hear that, sir? So do I have a king's face or don't I? Hmm. Absolutely not. Oh. Those sleek waxed eyebrows. Redden eyes from too much screen time. Cavities from devouring far too many sweet treats. Let's face it, you're a mess. Oh, please, sir, bread. Mm -hmm. Give me the face of a real king, won't you? Why do you want a king's face anyway? Our nation suffers the cruel whims of the cake queen. If I become king, I will save Bakery Town from her tyranny. But you're talking about high treason here. That's right. You must <gasps> help me. I have witnessed Her Highness plundering food. I have seen her push aside her minions and meet their pleas of mercy with threats of violence. That's not your sofa! You dare defy your queen? Go, take him to the dungeon immediately! No! Please! Hmm. Just hearing your tale makes me sore. Deposing this tyrant will save our country! Master Bread, you'll help me, won't you? Yes, I will help you. You have my solemn word. Follow me, Your Highness. Huh. Uh, huh? Please, have a seat. Huh. Obtaining the face of a king can cause great suffering. Can you handle such pain, sir? If it means I can become king, I will endure any pain whatsoever. Mm. Very well. I will give you a king's face. Uh, what do you think you're doing? The king's forehead must look royal oh. and as vast as the land he surveys. Hmm. His eyebrows should resemble an eagle in flight. Hmm. His nose a great rock. His lips the red of two sacred dragons. And a mole to symbolize good fortune with a strand of hair like a wild orc. There, my work is good. <laughs> what could be the matter? Oh. What have you done? What made me repulsive? That's a... Uh, is a king's face. Must I have a face as hideous as this to become a king? Then I am willing to suffer this ugliness to dethrone my sister. Wait! <laughs> Never try to erase that face, you hear? If you do, then you might... No entry! Hmm. 
Oh, wow. That is truly disgusting. There goes my lunch. <laughs> How dare they try to stop me. Now I am the king of Bakery Town. Oh, hey. <laughs> Your Majesty, the citizens are complaining about the skyrocketing prices of housing. Ooh. Perhaps those without housing should stay at hotels. Mm -hmm. Hello, oh. Queenie. <laughs> what? <gasps> Who is this hideous person? But don't you recognize your brother? You can't be Butter Waffle? That's right. And you are no longer the queen of Bakery Town. For now, Butter Waffle is the king. You're crazy! Hurry! Throw this ugly waffle out of here! Ma'am! <laughs> <laughs> yes, perhaps that might have worked before. But you see now, I have the face of a king! I can't look at you anymore! Please go away! <laughs> now, I possess the throne! <laughs> well, now that I am king, you must all do my bidding. So raise your heads up. Raise your heads. I am your king. <laughs> Why are you laughing? I have never seen a face as ugly as that before. My eyes are killing me. <laughs> Stop laughing. He looks even uglier when he's angry. <laughs> Look, my subjects all mock me and disobey me. What is going on? Your Highness, perhaps you should stop worrying and just enjoy the party. Party? A banquet has been prepared to celebrate King Butterwaffle. I've invited some delicious desserts. Really? Well, let's go. <laughs> ah, such pretty pastries all for me. <clears throat> is it true Butterwaffle is the new king? Since when does a bedwetter get to be king? I'm so glad you could come to my banquet. It's sure to be a wonderful party. So now that I'm king... Oh, what's going on with his face? We should go before we catch it! Oh. What do you think happened to him? Not only is he a bedwetter, but his face is a disaster! Huh? This is awful! They're all scared away by my face! Perhaps your huh? subjects need a bit more time to get used to it, sire. Ah! Oh. I've got a brilliant idea. How about holding a public coronation ceremony to introduce the people to their brand new king? Coronation? That sounds pretty good to me. I wonder what the new king looks like. Yeah, I hear he's the cake queen's brother. Oh. Hmm? <laughs> Citizens of Bakery Town, I present to you your new sovereign, King Butterwaffle the First. Huh? <gasps> <laughs> Check out that face, will you? Those puppy red lips are a scream! Oh, well, his forehead's so wide. Is he balding? What's with that hair and his mole? <laughs> Mama, the new king is really ugly, huh? You mustn't say. Oh, he is pretty homely, isn't he? <laughs> we should call him King of the Wobble! <laughs> Stop laughing, I say! <laughs> Look at those puffy lips quivering! Boy, that boat here is flapping in the wind! <laughs> ah! Why? I thought I would have the respect of my subjects, date lots of delectable desserts, and be loved and admired by my people, when all they do is laugh at me! A lucky mole indeed! Needs two puffy dragon lips anyway. The rock notes, how silly and smelly. It's time to bring these eagle wing brows down to earth. And I'm not balding either. Thank goodness my handsome face is back again! No, Your Majesty, without your king face, you might lose the crown you fought for. <laughs> I'm going to have fun today! Butter Waffle! Ah! You dare to covet my throne, you fool! But sister, how did you escape the dungeon? We let her out! You were able to steal the crown only because of that ugly face of yours. Now that your monstrous face is gone, I demand you renounce the throne! 
butter waffle. I'll make you pay for your treachery. Do you hear me? No! The next day. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Huh? Oh, uh, pardon me. Excuse me, miss. Uh, thank you. What? Make way! <laughs> <sighs> that waffle betrayed the queen. Yeah, that guy went and changed his face and everything. That's right, and all for power. I told him never ever to erase that face. For now, he's only left with a frown. <laughs> Best Sausage Contest, Part 1. And premium pet food for the first place winner? No, I need to enter. That prize is mine! Sausage, get ready! Yes, <laughs> 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 that's weird. Wow, it looks like every sausage and bakery town is here. <gasps> Look at that. Sausage is going down. Know why? Because this guy's a breadwinner. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, your attention. It's time for the competition. <laughs> the first round is an obstacle course. Only the sausages that defeat each and every obstacle can advance into the next round. Ready to begin. <laughs> Approaching the finish line, Sebastian finally uh, woke up. What? Sebastian? Ah, uh, yes. Yeah. As the defending champion, he looks very confident. He's just starting now. He can't do that. As 
predicted, Sebastian has completed the first race. You see, he's undefeated for a reason, folks. <laughs> My Sebastian's number one. What in the? This is completely unfair. The competition's rigged. Hmm. Time for the competition's second event. Get ready. This challenge is an IQ test. The rules are simple. When I ask a question, the sausages run to the answer they think is correct. The game continues until only two finalists are left. Let's begin. Question one. Of these desserts, which would you say is the villain? Choice one is this devilish apple pie. Choice two is the angelic cake queen. Choose a side. Go! What an easy question. You'd have to be a dummy to mess this one up. Ah, what are you doing, you reckless wieners? Sebastian, how could you? Change the question now! Yes, ma'am. Uh, uh... Actually, that was the wrong question. Here's the real first question. Which one of these things do sausages like to eat? Choice one, who? Two, a bone. Choose your answer. Now run over. This question's as easy as pie. It's obviously the bone. Oh, Mr. Red, look over there. Ah! The sausages chose the bone. <laughs> Those sausages must eat their poo. That's disgusting! Ah! Sebastian, how could you hit that one? Something or else! Yes, ma'am. <laughs> yeah, the correct answer is number two, the bone. A difficult question for sure. But the two remaining sausages are... The undefeated champion, Sebastian, and Master Bread Sausage. Yeah, Sausage made it to the final round. He could win. <laughs> oh, how, how did Sebastian manage uh, to get into the finals? No idea. And what you've been waiting for, the final round begins. Yeah! So let me introduce the two remaining sausages to you. Contestant one, the top IQ, the cutest looks, and best temperament is Angry Town's favorite sausage. And then there's the other sausage. Looks are average, average IQ, just average overall. It's Master Bread Sausage. Who will be crowned champion of the 10th annual Best Sausage Contest? And so, the final round. Best Sausage Contest Part Two. Pastries and gentlemen, is everybody ready? Because we're about to enter the final round! The category is a beauty contest. Each sausage will be styled by a different barber. Whichever sausage looks the most styling will be declared the winner. We already know who's gonna win. Yeah, nobody can beat Sebastian. Uh, we won't know until the contest is over. We're in it to win. Master Bread's a genius, you know? Uh -huh. Where is he? Gone. Okay, what say we meet our barbers? The barber who will be styling Sebastian's hair. <laughs> Bakery Town's most dazzling barber, Master Bread! <laughs> really? What are you trying to pull? Keep it down! Listen, the Queen said if I stylized her sausage, she'd give me ten times the prize money! But, <sighs> sir, switching sides like this isn't cool! You're betraying us for more money, you traitor! Now, who will step in to style Master Bread's sausage, I wonder? Oh, without Master Bread, how are we gonna win? Well, I think you might be the man of the hour. What? You want me to compete against Master Bread? It's either that or we forfeit. Here. Oh, I don't know about this. You'll be great. Oh. Hey, isn't that Wilk? It is! He works in Master Bread's barbershop. What? This is Wilk, Master Bread's assistant. <sighs> Looks like I'll be styling you. Ah, Wilk, might want to quit while you're ahead, kid. <laughs> don't try to psych him out, you backstabber! Well, are you ready, folks? 
Great. Scissors up. Let's get styling! <laughs> These sausages are about to get a whole new look. Sebastian, I just hope you're ready to take first place. I have some serious skills, you know. Ah! Hey, let that go of me! Get off my nose, will ya? Ah! Oh, Sebastian, his nose does look like a big round tennis ball. You oh. stupid sausage! Get off of me! Wilk, that's your cue. Sebastian's latched onto the nose of that traitor. He's actually helping us out. Yeah, okay. <laughs> uh -huh. Wait a minute. <laughs> <laughs> Sebastian, are you ready to get some style? What's with this mutt? You spoiled sausage! What? How dare he call him that? Send that insolent bread to the dungeon at once or else! Please remain calm, Majesty. The contest isn't over yet. You're right. Well, then, as soon as it's over, you hear? Get away from me! Uh, well, that certainly was quite an exciting round, but it's come to an end. Let's check out those fabulous results, shall we? Wow, Master Bread Sausage is as elegant a vision as this contest has ever seen. Why, thanks. <laughs> and now, let's see what Sebastian looks like. Uh, well, Sebastian's... I'm afraid I'm a bit at a loss for words. Oh. Now, let's bring out our surprise final round judge, shall we? Welcome, the Cake Queen! <laughs> Are you kidding? That's right. First place will be decided by Her Majesty. Since I am sponsoring this contest, I promise to be fair. Really, you can trust me. Uh, you'll be fair, all right. But their surprise judge is always the queen. Uh, it's obvious uh, who's gonna win. Time for my totally unbiased decision. We'll start with Master Bread Sausage. That creamy bouffant is so outdated. Uh, it's far too exaggerated and authoritarian. Zero. Uh, now my next decision. How beautiful! This crazy natural look is much more up to date. A true trendsetter. I give Sebastian 100. The winner is Sebastian, of course. Sebastian, congratulations on your 10th trophy for best sausage. A big surprise. Sebastian won it again. How do we even come to these things? How could Master Bread do that to us? It sure is unfair. Sausage, you are awesome. The real winner today was you. Surprise! <laughs> gotcha. You really did well up there. You traitor. Master Bread, you helped Sebastian win today. How could you? Uh, uh, let me explain. Ta-da! I didn't have enough money to buy a new house for sausage, you see. So when the queen made her offer, I couldn't turn it down. The fact that our sausage never had his own house has always broken my heart. Sir, I knew it. Mm. You were thinking of sausage all along. Uh, of course. I love my little sausage baby so much. Sausage, now you have a cozy house all your own. Master Bread. Ha, 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 ha,